Kenyan taxpayers not to pay taxes until the government finds an alternative way of sourcing for the funds and increasing university fees is tantamount to a felony because the university students come from various backgrounds majority of whom come from very poor backgrounds and having been at the university and a student leader I know the pain that these comrades are going through. The help that is being given at the moment is not even sufficient to fund the fees at the universities, to fund education at the universities, because the help that is being given is at a maximum of around 40 to 50,000, of which 30,000 goes to fees, then another 8,000 goes to accommodation, there is food to be procured, there are uh, reading materials to be procured too. So these students literally have nothing left. And any attempt to increase these varsity fees will be met with equal force. And I will personally be at the forefront to mobilize university students across the nation to organize for serious demonstrations that will go to state house. Every state lodge, every state house in this country will be visited by those comrades. And we ask the president to cook for these comrades because they will come visit you. We don't want jokes. We've given you your time. We accepted the results, even though we didn't agree with them. But right now it's your time to work. I remember you said very well that university fees will be free. I remember very well. And you said that help will be a grant. What has happened all of a sudden? In these developed countries, university is free of charge. And we expect this government to treat education with a lot of respect, to treat our students with a lot of respect, and ensure that help is a grant, and ensure that university students are not paying varsity fees. Thank you very much, but just know that we are going to come with serious action should there be this attempt.